Hmm. This is disappointing. No. Disappointing is the Jets losing in the last two minutes. Not being covered in slime by phantom ghouls out to kill us doesn't exactly make me reach for a hang. Why they shut down? You guys didn't bang the place up that bad last time you were here. If this place is a Mandala note, a few burnt walls and broken ceilings are the last thing that anybody's... And smashed furniture, broken chandeliers, destroyed paintings, shattered vases, probably some minor structural damage. Thanks, Egon. My point being that there's more to worry about here than some minor cosmetic issues. Definitely a Mandala node. If we don't shut down Shandor's Mandala soon, most of Manhattan will become as vacant as this. Not to mention also becoming a bastion of absolute mind-numbing horror for centuries to come. Hey, I definitely don't lay out two grand a month for a 600 square foot walk-up to live in a bastion. Let's get to work. All right, let's get to work, guys. Hope you're all doing awesome, Possum. Welcome back to part two of Ghostbusters, the video game. I think we're about halfway done with the game, so I'm counting on this stream being the final part. All right, so we're back at Hotel Sedgwick. This is the uh, hotel from the uh, from the first movie and the hotel that I was at at the beginning hey, of the game. Here, come on. What is it, Ray? What's going on, Home Slice? I'm co I'm I'm coming. He seems to be going nowhere, though. <laughs> Whoa! Look out! What are we looking out for? Why Why are these guys freaking out? All right. Anyway, we got to be on it's the an lookout. Ambush. Get them hot. Is it? Wait a minute. Wait. Oh. I don't think they're a threat. Oh. They may only be residual hauntings. Oh. I think Ray is right. They haven't crossed entirely into this dimension. They're just psychokinetic echoes, ghosts of ghosts, completely harmless. Great. I was hoping to meet a friendly ghost someday, but I'll settle for harmless right now. I'm getting a strong valence spike higher up in the building. Alyssa said she was called to the 12th floor. Let's start there. Wow, 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 wow. We got an artifact, baby. Some floating pants. Yo, password, what's going on, dude? 13K subs, yeah. The channel finally creeped past the 13,000 sub mark. I get about, I've, I've trickled down to about one new sub a day. <laughs> because I usually gain like three subs a day, but then I lose about two subs a day. So it, it equals out to about one sub a day. So uh, in another thousand days, I might reach 14K. <laughs> but no, no, seriously, I appreciate you guys. Yo, Corvid, what's going on? Good to see you. All right, we got some possessed bell-bottom jeans from 1970. Rumored to have first been haunted during a seance on the Merry Pranksters tour bus, these jeans have long been a staple of the psychedelic supernatural underground. Spotted backstage at Woodstock, caught on grainy 16mm film in the candlelit background of a height Ashburg Ashbury Lovin, ew, photographed riding behind a member of a notorious biker gang fleeing Altamont, the walking pants had been around whenever weirdness or tragedy strikes the hipster scene. The walking pants are the hippie equivalent to the girl on the road ghost story. Prior to their resurfacing this year, they haven't been seen since 1981. Wow, truly fascinating, guys. This way. By the way, if my if my voice sounds a little stuffy today, it's because it kind of is. My my cats seem to have been doing their best lately to try to make sure I do not get enough sleep at night, and I am I am very tired. But that's not gonna stop us today, guys. We got ghosts to bust. Okay, we got we got we got to bust ourselves out today. I'm taking my sweet time looking for artifacts because that's Come how you on, make the ca Ray, slow your roll, homie. I'm trying to get money to buy more upgrades. All right, let's do it. Nothing. They'd have shut down the power when they closed. Can we take the stairs? Well, we can try climbing, but the last time we were here, a level three animator took out the bottom of the staircase. 
Yeah, that's right. I forgot you weren't here last time, Winston. So no stairs, no elevators. Did you hear something? Over there. Come on. Where? I think we're dealing with a level five anchored ambusher. Be careful. <laughs> it went into the stairwell. We've got it cornered. Help! This is just how a level five anchored ambusher lures you in. I'm ready for him, dude. I'll bust all over him. The manager? What are you doing here? Ghosts. Monsters. Everywhere. There was another voice. A woman screamed. Are you alone in here? Well, I just said ghosts. Monsters everywhere. Does that sound like I'm alone? He meant people. Then yes. I think so. <laughs> well, I guess that explains it. <laughs> Sir, there's no need to fear. These are just shadows, <laughs> echoes of actual ghosts. They can't hurt you. Come with us, sir. We can lead you to safety. That was the manliest scream I've ever seen anyone do. My god. That was a war cry if I've ever heard one. Let's go check up the stairs, though, to see if there's any art of- Oh! Oh, oh, hold up. It, it turned blue for a moment. We got ourselves something up the stair. Wait, hold up. I'm not able to get up there? F off! Oh, hold up. Oh, it's right here. It's a newspaper. Or something. <laughs> it's the Broccoli Queen Autobiography. Man, we got lots of reading, you guys. Sit back, relax, grab a cup of joe, and enjoy. 1973, as related in her book, Confessions of a Broccoli Queen... The beautiful Sydney Chalmers came to the big city with big dreams and big bazonkas, no doubt, and a modeling contract and was selected Broccoli Queen of the Thanksgiving Day Parade in 1967. Little did she know that would be the pinnacle of her career. She went to Hollywood to make movies, but only appeared in a string of low-grade exploitation films. No doubt for the big bazonkas. A life of ongoing wild parties and desperation led her to pen a sexy and scathing tell-all of the beauty industry. Sydney died in a tragic and somewhat sus suspect hot tub accident the day the book hit the stands. She never knew that she'd finally found the success she craved, as the book entered bestseller lists and remained there for over two years. Not really cursed, but it's a really, really good airplane read. How do I find myself a broccoli queen, guys? How does one go about that? Gotta get me one of those. Oh. Oh. The Black Widow. <laughs> Someone you know? I don't know. Most of the old staff knows the story of the Spider Witch, a professional widow who did unimaginable things in a room on the 12th floor back in the 1920s. Butt stuff. Unimaginable. What are you still doing here? Why didn't you evacuate with everyone else? I came back last night to retrieve some payroll records, but the hotel won't let me out. The door's shut on me, and the phones are down too. That means we're trapped now too. And we have to hope that Peter figures out we're missing. There goes a weekend. Not necessarily. The 12th floor is apparently the core of this node. If we can get the power back on, we can take the elevators. If the elevators don't eat us. Yes, if the elevators don't eat us. <laughs> Where are the circuit breakers for this place? We don't have a lot of time. Breakers. In my office. But the city came and turned off most of our power after the electrical fire on the third floor. There's no way to turn it back on from here. That's inconvenient. We've got to find some way to get the elevators moving. There's a backup generator in the utility room, off the kitchen. It's for emergency blackouts. Perfect. Let's give it a try. To the kitchen. To the kitchen. Gonna make a snack. Watch out! Three flanked! No! On the right! Yeah. Ooh, yeah. 
Oh! On your left! These suckers are going flying. It's okay. Rookie was free. Oh! Bang. Freeze him up, freeze him up, and blast him away. Wait a minute. Give it to him. This guy just came out of nowhere. Oh, eat it. Get wrecked. I guess some of them apparently fulminate to this plane that doesn't seem like they're happy about. Right. Now, let's find that backup generator. The kitchen. Is it through here? Yes, just down the hall. <laughs> Nighty night, sweet prince. Oh, yeah, Corbett. This hotel does not stand a chance. Hello? Anyone there? All right, guys, spread out. The utility room should be around here somewhere. Got a collectible. In some dark, scary corner. I know I've said this before, but be careful. Don't think well. Eh. Eh. It's a cursed artifact, a cruel oven. Alarming banging and cries for help drift from inside the microwave. The origins of this evil cooking device are unclear. What is known, however, is that the demons and devils apparently love a home-cooked meal. Wholesome. Heads up, cadet! My head's up. Don't worry, Ray. Did you hear the whispers? It said the food is mediocre and the service is lacking? Scathing review. We got we currently have a Yelp reviewer ghost Move within the kitchen. Someone's saying murderer. Ugh, Did you and Beekman do all this when you were chasing Slimer? No, this is a lot worse than they left it. This is the work of something big. When you say big, do you mean big, big? Mm-hmm. At the very least, mm -hmm. maybe even bigger. That sounds like big. <laughs> bigger than big. Said there was a generator room around here somewhere. Ladies. Look for a door. It has to be around here somewhere. Keep an eye out for a sign. Oh, I'm looking for a sign. Gonna make it mine. It's gonna be real fine. It's gonna be right on time. I'm gonna let my skills shine. It's gonna be real sublime. Generator room. We're in it to win it, folks. Look, Cadet found the emergency generator. Sure look did. Look for a switch or something to start it up. What's it look like? Probably like a switch, or something that would start up a generator. All right, Egon, but you should know I'm keeping score. What did I say? There's a lot of water on the floor. Watch out for static discharge when you activate the generator. You mean to say he could be electrocuted oh, after the music. power's back on? No! I recommend not stepping in that water. That sounds like an excellent recommendation. Looks like that power cable is causing all the trouble. Get it out of the water, then. I know this much. We're trapped down here like rats until that cable's out of the water. How about some slime tethering? I'm on it, homie. I got it. Can I actually connect it to that? Oh, this is cool, man. I'm all about it. Come on, kid. The I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Something... Never mind. Let's get back to the lobby. I do love to rhyme, Corvid. I do love it. What's that smell? Over there! Come on! Look out! It's the late ship! Yeah, but this is just the help. Where's what the is that ball? thing? Oh! I can't believe I just said that out loud. I know that guy! It's the master! <laughs> so, nobody eat anything in here, even if you're really hungry. I'm about to <laughs> oh, hey, that be okay? I'm trying to try to scare. <laughs> what is that? Spirit guide updated. 
He goes down. That's a whole lot of what ever. Let's try out our uh, our new weapon type. Oh, wait, hold on. We, we, we got to close these portals, man. I'm down. I'm Scott and he was going on. Good to see you. All right, we got a nut all over him. Beautiful. All knowledge is useful knowledge. All right, we got quite a few new scans. All right, let's rock and roll, baby. It's a whole swarm. <laughs> Ooh, that I'm hit. I need some help. Be there in a flash. A couple of my homies are down. Aim high. I'm down. <laughs> Hold tight. Ooh, close one. I'm warming up, guys. I'm Hold warming tight. up, okay? Here they come. Oh. Ah. Raise down. Ooh, man. Gotta move. Hold him down. Let's capture this a-hole. Yeah, he's fighting it. Got him. Let's get our boys back up. Come on, you sleeping on the job? They're bringing some thunder. Wait, what did he just say? I'm on your team. Damn, these guys are strong. More than My I face! Expected. My face! Fear! Right there! Light them up! Keep your eyes peeled! Aim high! Alright, let's toss another box out. Right there! Yeah, you sucker! Come on! Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, get in there. Get in there. Yeah. You like that? You like that? On the right. All right, raise down. Get your ass up, buddy. Winston's down as well. Over here. They're all down. Oh, are you serious right now? Hang on. I'm down. I think we're going to lose this. Come on. Do that again. I dare you. Got to get my boys back up. I'm hit! I'm hit! Oh. Here they come! Careful, we almost crossed streams. Winston is down yet again. Winston, get it together. Who's the rookie here? Look out! Above you! Knock it off! Watch it! Run! I'm hit. Oh. Run for it! I said it before and I'll say it again. Uh -oh. <laughs> Incoming! Watch out, would you? To the right! There he is. On your left! Yeah. Uh -oh. Up there! Uh, almost there! Hey, see you later, Corbin. Just taking a little nap, just taking a breather, you know. Here they come. Where is this guy? Oh, All right, I he's tuckered you. out, but I'm down. Run! Ow! Way to go, Greenhorn! Man down, man down. You play hard ball. Got him in there, baby. Ow! They got me, they got me. Ooh, the chaos. It's not alone. Aim high. I'm on your side. Try to slow these guys down. Froze his ass. Oh my god. 
Uh oh. Help me. Uh oh. Come on, Ray. It's all up to you, Ray, baby. Ray's Bay. Ray's Bay. Hang on. We stirred up a hornet's nest, kid. A five. Hey! Oh! Ow! Nice, right, get him in there. To the right. Come on, you fat ass sack of crap. You own that creep. Check your aim. All He's right. in. This kitchen is clean. Let's get back to the elevator. Hot diggity dog. That was. That was quite the warm up. You know, can we buy any upgrade stuff and things? We got 26 cash, 26,000 cash money, homies. Let's see. Uh, we could do blast stream focusing reduces beam wandering. All right, ten K. Uh, we could do stream recoil decrease removes movement restriction restrictions with the blast uh, The main blast wave We're down to 16k. Can we do any more upgrades that sound desirable? Slime tether cost reduction. It's eight grand. I don't really care about that one though kind of sounds like it doesn't really matter we could do Mason or Mason, Mason, I don't know. Collider penetration, 7Gs, adds shot penetration. That could come in handy when there's a bunch of ghosts around. We're down to 9Gs now, homies. We could do overload pulse accelerator, rate of fire increase. Beautiful, beautiful. Almost got every single damn upgrade in the game. Yes, the only one we don't have right now is the tether uh, cost reduction, which I don't really care too much about, to be completely honest with you. Hey, watch it! My bad, homie. My bad. My B. Thank God you're here. Okay, it looks like the cycle mass has come to rest about 190 feet above our heads. The 13th floor. This hotel has no 13th floor. None of the grand old hotels do. Man's got a strong argument. We'll split the difference. Egon, you and the Tenderfoot go to the 12th floor. Winston and I will check out the 14th. Uh, sir, if you'll please come with us. Fine, but stay in contact. This place is extraordinarily dangerous. There's a artifact somewhere nearby. But where? But where? Really? Freaking out like right there. Oh, hold on. Can we get through here with slime? Is that a dumb waiter? I don't know what's going on there. Because weakness is slime, caustic one. Did I just not slime it all the way? How do I open this? There's something back there, guys. 
There's something inside. How do we open it? That's the question. I lose in my mind. It's in there, I know it is. But I don't know how to get in there. Oh. <laughs> Look, okay, I'm a rookie, okay? It's, 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 I'm new to the job. It's a Swiss death clock. 1821, the infamous Swiss death clock was constructed by Herschel Glücke, genius but demented watchmaker. It is intended to show the exact time of death of anyone that comes near it. When placed in the firehouse in close proximity to so many past life entities, the clock's hands spin out of control. Peter uses it as a desk fan. Okay. Okay. Oops, didn't mean to do that. I always click tab to try to close the PKE. <laughs> By accident. You hear that? Oh, I've already, I've already got this one. All right. Anyway, let's go ahead back over to where we need to be. We activated the Jenny, so now we should be able to go back over yonder. Move, Junior. Getting slimed is the last thing I wanted to do today. Well, let's see what's on the 12th floor. Come on in, boys. The water's fine. Or not. Hey, God. What were you saying earlier about the Mandala new? You mean, why do we keep seeing new ghosts? Yeah. Okay. Think of the Mandala as a city bus line. At the bus station, ghosts or waiting passengers are drawn into the system here and trapped. This concentrates their PK energy, which is then eventually forced through to the next node or station, and so on until it all ends at the final terminus. At each successive bus station, the station manager absorbs some of the energy. This makes the station manager, or node guardian, stronger so that it can keep the ghosts in line and destroy anyone who comes to the station to interfere with the flow. These nodes, or bus stations, gather the power used to feed a central point, thus creating a much bigger threat to our world. Does that make more sense now? TTTC, Totally Trapped Transit Company. Yeah, you were going strong right up until the passengers got trapped inside the bus station. When is my performance review again? I deserve more stock options. I say, young lady, you hey, have baby. Full of surprises. After you, my dear. Well, that was terrifying. Be extremely careful. This is likely to be a point of dangerous concentration. Surely. Surely. Now we gotta find the Mandala node. Oh, it's coming from everywhere and nowhere. Impossible to get a significant fix. Ray, come in. Are you there? He gone. What happened? We lost you for a minute there. We had a close contact. I've got some more information on the Spider Witch ghost. The manager says authorities never found her, but the bodies were hung from the ceiling. They were drained of blood and dragged around. Ew. He says the victims were found in a pretty bad state. The walls were painted in blood. 
furniture was half chewed and crushed and piled in a corner like a giant nest. She seems to have vandalized the room badly, too. Hmm. I don't want to be hung from a ceiling and drained of blood. I tell you this much, I do not want to be found in a bad state or vandalized. <laughs> I think that sentiment is unanimous. Let's keep moving. What is happening? Someone having diarrhea in here? Oh, it's a cursed phantom flush toilet. Nineteen oh six presented to His Majesty Edward the Seventh as a diplomatic gift from the Moroccan ambassador. This stunning specimen a specimen of engineering and craftsmanship has been a harbinger of disaster and death since its initial casting. Unbeknownst to the ambassador, a Turkish drowning demon was bound to the magnificent throne as a fiendish assassination assassination ploy. An insolent under butler became the seat's first British victim. When said servant tried to use it before Edward had a chance, the under butler was dragged to his horrible watery doom, and the toilet was quickly removed from the royal palace and thrown into the rubbish. It has since passed through many hands and households, spawning terror and tragedy in each. Even in this day and age, it is difficult to imagine that such a work of beauty is so incredibly deadly. Oh yes. Oh yes. I'd sit on that baby. I'd sit on that baby hard. Not really, but okay. Let's keep moving. We got some big readings here. <laughs> Ray, come in. Yeah, what's up? What was the Spider Witch's room number? 1221. After her spree, it was locked up. Until about five years ago when we remodeled. Hear that? Room 12. Oh, greet our visitors. Hello? Are you ready? I was born ready. Just We're not alone in here. Making sure I'm not missing any artifacts over yonder. Whoa! This floor is undergoing significant metamorphosis. Ghost World is aggressively encroaching on ours. It's not even utilizing a portal. This is very bad. Is it weird that I'm kind of into this chick? <laughs> What the hell is the matter with me? My ankles. Goodness, we hardly know each other. What? Who? What are you? No! Help! No, please. No! Yeah, she's doing butt stuff to him, no doubt. Sounds like it. That's an exit only, guys. That's an exhaust port. No entry. It's the ghost world crossing through, happening sooner than we expected. It looks like this is where the node is focused. We could use some help. Ray, are you there? Come in, Ray. Looks like it's up to us. Let's find 1221 and finish this. Okay, let's finish it. Let's finish. There's an artifact down here somewhere. It's getting red hot. What the f the unruly beard of V. Belascu. This disgusting tangled mass of hair twitches and squirms. 1933, Russian demonologist Vladimir Beluski, or is it Beluchu? Belachu, I don't know, performed exorcism throughout central Russia in the 20s and early 30s. He never noticed that one of the very minor subdemons he cast out had escaped into his beard. A massive and wild nest that stirred envy in most men. 
Upon his death, the possessed beard left Belasco's face and stowed aboard a freighter to the Americas. The beard has a tendency to affix itself to the chins of unknowing victims while they speak to mock them. But rarely does any real harm. Hmm, okay. Also, guys, I'm kind of ashamed to say, but I just noticed that you can see your PKE meter on your hip when you're walking around in third person, so you don't need to be in first person to see it turn blue. I'm just an idiot. You know, that's how we do it. That's how we do it here on the Evil Good Guy channel, guys. Not trouble. Ah. Come on. Oh, they got some bodies. 22. No 1221. Where is it? 1221 has to be here. Never trust the naked eye in this work. I'm sure it's here, even if we can't see it. Totes. Gotta goo it up. Good thinking. It was here all along. All right, before we venture forth into the 1221 dormitory, let's go see if there are any more artifacts to collect to be had. Does not appear to be the case. Oh, that was weird. He just made that body disappear. Well, this looks inviting. Sure does. I don't like the look of this, but we've run out of options. Come to me, little man. Oh, baby. All right. I'll come all right. I'm not afraid. Where are you, mama? Not sure I like her calling me little man, though. <laughs> okay, I'm not really into her anymore. It's over, you know? It was, it was a short, fast fling, but it's gone. It's, the fire is burnt out. The passion is no more. The spark has withered away. Time to kill this b****. With the giggling, she's so giggly and bubbly. Really, the really the life of the party, you know. Alone. Explore the spider witch's lair. Which ones are these? These are not Chick is crazy. I think she needs some therapy. Something happened to her as a child, no doubt. Oh! Okay, I can't forget to scan her ass. We'll get some good cash money for that ass. Pretty sure you're the one who's gonna feel the tiny prick, lady. <laughs> oh, feels bad.
Where's my homeboy? Night in shining proton pack time. Hello? Is my guy invisible? Where'd you go, homie? I know the game wants us to go to the center area, probably. I'm just searching around for artifacts. Just so you guys are aware. All right, let's get this party started. Come and find me if you can. I, I am, I will. Heads up! Got her. Okay, you sneaky little devil you, you little witch. Where's my boy at? I'm all alone. Doesn't feel good. There he is. I'm coming, buddy! I'm coming! Oh, he got me. Let's slow her ass down a little bit. Find the spider witch and interrupt her feeding. Blast it! getting wrecked. Hey, baby. I like the way you move. You got those moving and grooving skills. Don't let it recharge. Okay, she's over this way. Somewhere. Crap. You're up. Keep it up, kid. Got her. Sure did, girl. Sure did. Another Look, boss down. The mandala man. Ray, Winston, come in. You there? We got three out of four. What happened? You all right? Their recruit found the 13th floor and we shut it down. PKE levels are back to acceptable parameters. This note of the mandala is fully neutronized. All right. Where are you? We went back down to the 12th floor and couldn't find anything. Everything seems pretty normal. Looks like we're back in the Ruby Ballroom. We'll meet you at Ecto-1. Egon, remind me, why are we driving aimlessly in the fog? The final node, Beckman. Close it, and we seal the mandala, trapping the ghosts inside. Sorry to break this to you, Egon, but I just don't see a mandala. You were saying? Shandor Island. It's here.
stable. I'm gonna have to drop you guys in circle. If Ecto-8 sinks, we're sunk too. Ray, since you're the most excited about going to Ghost Island, why don't I just take the boat? I, I, I thought I was making a nice gesture. You're giving me the suspicious look. <laughs> drop it instantly. Let's get going, because nobody enjoys rushing headlong towards their death more than this fellow. Absolutely. Damn it, Venkman, this is serious. Pull it together. What's the story behind this place, he got? The Shandors owned this island for generations. The castle was built in the 1860s. Evo Shandor used it as a refuge, a lab, and a temple for he and other cult members to worship Gozer. Ooh, okay, that's all well and good. But can someone explain to me how an entire island sinks? The night the last Shandor died, there was a huge tidal surge, and the river just swallowed the island whole. Shandor consecrated the island to Gozer, and the ghost world reclaimed it. Uh -huh. City's lucky it's in the middle of the river instead of Rockefeller Center. We're lucky now. Soon the ghost world will continue to assert itself into ours, and the damage will be incalculable. Hmm. Just another screwed up day at the office. Totally. It appears that we need to take that staircase to get inside. Staircase. That's a big hole, guys. And I am not swimming in the Hudson River in November. So, how do you want to get across? Maybe that crane still works. Yeah, I had my eye on the crane. Well, if you could get that from over there to over here, make the world a better place. So the fossil Good idea. Old... Look at that. Rookie, move the crane. All right, swing it around. Almost. Work it over this way to cover the hole. Oh, there we go. Now we're moving. Bring it in. Almost there. Whoa. Great. Yo, new guy. Good work. Damn, I'm good. Holy crap. Come on, gentlemen. I think I'm the boss now. I think I'm the one in charge of the busters. Hands up. Oh! I just wanted you to see right? what would happen. What's with you? You know you're gonna get paid if you live. Recruit, you okay? Let's keep moving. <laughs> nice. I was curious if it was gonna be a ghost minecart or not. It clearly it was physical, it was real, it was possessed. Careful, we don't wear helmets. Guys, there's way too much dangerous debris falling in here. I've got to take Marine Ecto-8 out where it's safer. Don't go too far, Ray. If we need you, we're gonna need you really fast. Aye, aye, Z. Raise me on the horn if you need me. Check this joint out. That's a $3 million view, even by Manhattan standards. <laughs> My apartment used to look like this. Shandor's public architectural style ranged from federal to architecture. His personal tastes, however, obviously lean toward the Gozerian. Oh. Now I see what they mean by early demonic. Got an artifact right here. Strange book. Church of Gozer Songbook, 1919. Having resuscitated the dark Church of Gozer and wanting to increase its popular appeal, Evo Shandor made attempts at updating ancient Sumerian droning rituals to modern-day worship songs. The practice of singing in the dark church was abandoned soon afterward. And we are learning. Our brain is being engorged with knowledge. Oh, it feels good. Feels good. Just checking around, making sure we're not missing any other artifacts. All right, find a way into Shandor Castle. I don't like that. Well, that's a, there's an open door. Hey, we know those guys. Yeah! 
Slam that ass, baby. Slam that ass. Straw. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my, my bad, bro. They're gargoyles from Shandor buildings. Guess Evo would be tickled pink to know his old security system still works so long after he died. Uh, guys. That's a lot of whatever they are. Beautiful. All right, kicking ass, taking names, playing games. Play. These guys are pretty easy to destroy when you got, you know, a lot of clearance. Game's really making me make. But the door's controlled by that chain. Hey, you, you're up, buddy. Okay, cadet, you first. I've got Hold your on. back. Before we do that, let's go see if there's any delicious artifacts to be had. There are not. All right. Got to open this door back up. Did you know that historically hedge mazes are designed to conceal a secret shortcut? You hear that? Well, there's still one crank that works down there. Try using it to open the door. My PKE meter was lighting up blue for a moment there. <laughs> These noises, man. Hey! It's an anguished stuffed bear. The origin of this ratty old stuffed bear is not known, but its paranormal behavior, the emitting of an off-putting, though strangely compelling, cry of anguish has been periodically heard since the day it was removed from Klauff's Museum of Taxidermic Curiosities in December of 1867. Incredible. Incredible. Let's keep moving. This game's actually kind of creepy at times. I like it. Okay, we're back at the beginning. Be gone, Winston. Can we get out of here? Okay, here's the chain control thingy, Majig. We could probably use our uh, our tethers on it. I would imagine so, right? Wind the chain. Keep an eye out. Am I going the right way? That did it. The door's wide open. Get back up here. I think we gotta slam these guys. Okay, here they come. That's it. Wow! How much slime you got in there, ghost? Getting slimed is the last thing I wanted to do today. Okay, I was just checking for more artifacts. Looks like that was probably only one.
You got a porthole? Porthole be gone. Ticket, we're not welcome. Yeah? There's a first. I'm gonna get us all name badges that say, Hello, I'm not welcome. Or maybe t-shirts or coffee mugs. I'd wear that. Alyssa, I see her. You and me both. <laughs> Your range is as simple as I can. Uh, and she's brought me coffee. That's her, all right. Spitting image. The resemblance is uncanny. This is Evo Shandor's mother, painted in 1885. Mama. Wait. What? Alyssa is a Shandor? Why does this always happen to me? I meet a girl, she's crazy about me, but she always turns out to be some kind of unbelievable fixer of her. This is all making sense. Alyssa must have inadvertently <laughs> triggered the mandala because she has Shandor blood. And she doesn't know it. When I did her profile, she told me she was adopted. Some coincidence, huh? You don't really believe this happened by accident. No. Someone must have known and set this up. The mayor did say that Peck personally recommended Alyssa to be the guest curator of the Gozer exhibit. Once a Peck, always a Peck. Shandor must have employed hundreds of workers for years to build this place. The supports are waterlogged, the mortar is decrepit, and the foundation is shattered. In purely physical terms, there's no way all this can still be standing. You sound like you're surprised. No, not really. It's beautiful in a horrific way. You can't deny the pure genius of Shandor. It's a pity that it was all used for evil. If he would have just channeled some of it for good, the things he could have done. Absolutely. This is very spooky. We got spooky ghost chains. You know, it's a classic decor. Shandor knows what he's doing. He's got the basics down. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Oh, it's back here. I, I just assumed it was behind that box. But I was indeed mistaken. Oh, it's a painting. Fox Hunt on Tiamat Island. 1910, artist and Shandor devotee Vikram Vidam painted this fanciful scene after attending a prestigious fox hunt on Tiamat Island. Gonna be honest, I'm not a fan of fox hunts. I think it's kind of... I think it's kind of for, like, little pussies. Most fox hunts, they, like, break the fox's leg and then let it go, and it's like, why would you want to kill a fox? Foxes are awesome, dude. I don't want to kill that fox. I want to be that fox's friend. Dude, I would love to have a fox as a pet. Oh, my God. Could you imagine? Could you even imagine how awesome that would be? I'd be all about it. All about it. All right, what are we? Uh, what are we doing here? We're going through here is what we're doing. No, we're not. Just kidding. Customers black mass. What? People still worshiping even after they're dead. That's a powerful church, man. We're gonna slam these guys. I think I think that's my cue. Winston's always going down. Egon's down. Need some help here. I got you, bro. Incoming. Run. Nice. Over here. Ow. 
These guys could take a lot of damage. Get out of here. Hey, over here. A little help? Go, a little help? Keep it coming. Come on, Bankman. Chill, bro. Run! Ow! Oh. Ow! That was... That was... Ow! There. Ah! Gonna have to watch out for you. <laughs> oh no! Let's get these portals up. Let's close them up, baby. You got a mean street rook. Keep up with it. Over here. Almost got this bad boy. This is great. It is officially time for us to go. Now let's bounce. Check this joint. Unless my sensory array is malfunctioning, that is definitely the place we're looking for. <laughs> Come on. Secret trap door is nice. Come on out. Here, behind you. No, get back. Take your imaginary hands off me, man. No, there's too many. Egon, they got Egon. Bring it back here. Can't help us. It's all up to the rookie once again. Dude, I'm gonna be CEO before you know it. All right. Okay, you need to get to the other so we can help you. Please be careful. We don't know what we're dealing with. Here. But it sounds big. When big things attack, it hurts. Sure does. All right, let's investigate the catacomb, shall we? What the flip? Is that another spider? Looking for artifacts. That's a... Wow, God! You know what's up, Schwango? Dude, it's solid, man. It's 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 just like the first two movies. I can definitely see why why people unanimously consider this the official third movie that never happened. I'm looking for artifacts, not seeing a whole lot. Looks like we gotta move through here to get past that little blockade. Yes, we are on the other side. Wonderful. How you doing, Schwingo, by the way, man? Hope you're doing well. Oh. Slamming it up, busting on everything, baby. Oh, what was that? Come on, bro. We got an artifact around here somewhere. There it is! It's an ancient captain's wheel. The wheel of the Alabaster Wretch, 1796. The Alabaster Wretch was lost with all hands while carrying unspecified cargo from Zanzibar. Love that place. Been there many times. Classic vacation spot, let me tell you about it. One of the best. The ship's manifest records, the uneasy misgivings 
uh, of Captain Alfred Gaster. It says, crew is on edge. We hear the blasted singing from below decks both night and day now, but there's no one down there. I have resolved to pitch the, that cursed Albanian's strange-shaped crates overboard tonight, and if he protests, he'll go too. Solid captain. Good guy. Schwango, that is absolutely a heretical opinion. I like the first two movies. The other ones, you know, it's the... Obviously, the all-female reboot was, like, just awful. Just, just complete garbage. I think Bill, I think Bill Murray can be funny. I think there's sometimes when he's not very funny. <laughs> Sounds good, man. I mean, I'm honored that you like me more than you like Bill Murray. That's a big compliment right there. I'll take it. I'll take it. Dude, get busted. Sprinting. <laughs> the sprint ability is so weird in this game. What are all these noises? My goodness. Alright, nothing over there. Kind of strange. That's a lot of slimy goo. Drain the black slime from the catacomb tunnels. All right, so we could probably use our goo tethers, right? No? Gotta blow it up. Wait a minute, we got are these weights? Are these counterweights? They are okay, okay, okay. We gotta get those latched down into the bottom? Is that, is that what we're doing here? Beautiful. See, my brain works sometimes, you know. I'm not always Ricky Retardo. Hello? Hello? Got a big boy. Got a big boy. Let's scan his ass so we can get some cash money. Ooh. Oh, he's a class six. Oh, oh, good. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. 
All right, slime's slime's taking a toll on his ass. He's got nothing, baby. He's got nothing. Pretty easy to be honest. Just a little baby. Oh, it's because he's made of the black slime. Makes sense. It's pretty straightforward. Pretty simple. Busting all over him. Almost got him. Nice, easy, dude. Ain't no thing. Okay, let's close these portals up. Stop these guys from spawning. There was a portal over here. Let's go check it out. Eh. Is it gone? It was right here. I could, I saw it. Well, okay then. Rock and roll. We got flashing lights. It's pretty much the game saying, "Come check me out." Since we have an artifact nearby. I wonder if I can open this gate. Maybe. There's gotta be a way, right? To get that artifact over there? Maybe we can come back to it. Who's to say? Speaking about Bill Murray, though, Schwango, uh, have you ever seen that, that video clip where he's doing some some interview and uh, he's sitting on, like, a large bar stool and he falls off of it? <laughs> that is solid. Cracks me up, man. I don't know why. Why is it so funny to watch people get hurt or like get into bad situations? A DVD, the Ghostbusters DVD. 2008, Shandor cultists searching for artifacts from the future that would reveal the outcome of their plan for world destruction retrieved only this sad, transparent attempt at cross marketing. It's an awesome movie, though. Available now only on DVD. Dose. Oh, by the way, we can probably buy that final upgrade now. We got 39,000 bucks. Oh, we can buy it, all right. Where is it? Final upgrade, it's slime tether cost reduction. We got it. Did we miss any other upgrades? I wish it was easier to see what ones you've purchased. Like, I wish there was like a, like an icon next to them so you didn't have to hover over each of them individually. It's kind of weird. All right, looks like we got all the upgrades so far. Don't know if there's going to be any more or not. Probably not. We shall see, though. Nope. nice and relaxing, honestly. Not even a problem. Surprised they didn't come from behind as well. That would have been a good opportunity. Oh, God. Down there. Can you find me? 
Maybe. I think you're getting close to me. The sounds are getting louder. You know, I always did like you more than the others did. <laughs> How do I get him out of here? He, he's inside this. Do I just open it? Hey. Ooh, thanks, man. I was seriously cramping up in there. This is all looking a little familiar. Ray would be giggling right now. This must be where all the mood slime came from. Look, they must have pumped it straight into the sewers from here. Nice. Let's go find Egon. Then we'll think about finding people. <laughs> He's not a fan of Bill Murray either. All right, I, I was just looking for artifacts. What is this place? It's like a whole production General's facility. Cult was working some crazy experiments in here. There's blue slime, pink slime, yellow slime, but every ghost in here is coated with black slime. What's generating it all? Where's it all coming from? That's the question. That's the mystery, ain't it? I don't see any pink slime. This guy's full of crap. Get my hopes up. Let's just close that, shall we? Find some cover. Let's close those portals. Gonna have to watch out for you. Being dead for 80 years sure hasn't improved these guys' disposition any. I'm not sure which one of you shoved me into that crate, but you all owe me a big apology. Winston's a little pissed off. Dag nabby! Come out of here! I got you, bro. They're bringing some thunder! Find some cover! Damn it, Winston. Get it together, man. This guy's almost donezos. Got You're one of them. The wrong side, Ghost. Chandor isn't here to help you now, is he? And Let's another one bites the dust. Like in a tiny little box, amigo. How much damage does it, does this other gun do? Not that much, but it is kind of fun to use, though. Run! Ah, this is the kind of stuff that really shows well on your review. I think you're really turning some heads back at the headquarters. Man, what are these spooks up to? I get the whole Mandela immortality and power thing. But what's up with all the slime signs? Maybe the slime is like sex lube or something. Maybe they're a sex cult. Ah, could be. Got to be sitting directly on a cross-dimensional portal. I think I hear you guys. Yes, that sounds like my equipment. You're getting close. Hang on, we're almost to you. Thank you. This is going to reflect well on your performance review. <laughs> Thank cases, God. I find close proximity to mildew stimulating. That was a little much, though. Have you seen Beckham? Well, you know, 
Have you looked for him? Well, you know. <laughs> seems to indicate that he's somewhere in this direction. Alright. Two of those portals are closed. Let's go get the other ones. That's good. Keep Winston's on. down again? Bro. Winston's down again. Get your ass up, boy. Back to the other side. Incoming! No. Oh, oh my way. lord. Oh. This, oh, this, this might be it. This might be it. Run. We, we might be oh. dunzos. One wrong move. Oh, oh we got this! Incoming. They're both down, they're both down. Get your ass up, boy! I'm hit! Need some help! You got a mean streak, Rook! Let him have it! Oh, I'm down! We up, we up, we up! Find some cover! I'm down! Okay, yeah, big boy's down, big boy's down. Behind you. Over here! Ah. Ah. That's gonna prove! Look out! Above you! Okay, yeah, we got Egon, beautiful. Guns down. Give him to him. This guy's going down. Yeah, baby. Run! I'm on my way. Incoming. Where's he at? This machinery indicates an astounding level of sophistication. Your evil notwithstanding, Evo Shandor was far ahead of his time. You know I have to take my hat off to Shandor? This lab was built how many years ago? It's truly impressive. It's likely Shandor was the parapsychology expert of his time. Stay in the light, Egon. <laughs> trying with you. Should we try to find Peter or we'll probably stash him around here somewhere? I'm starting to think Winston actually wants Peter dead. Kind of messed up. Help! Yo, little help! Shh. Shh. I think I hear. Did somebody call a break? Yep, that's me. Went all right. Now we're sure about this, right? We need to be at full strength to shut down this node. Way to go! I feel a momentum swing here in our favor. Get out there and find the Mandela node and shut it down. That should really piss someone off. Hey. I got places to go, people to meet. Can we move out of here? Great job, kid. Glad to hear Peter's okay. What are they doing? The readings are as big as those at the library when we crossed over. I think it's safe to assume that the machine they're working on was not built for a benign purpose. It's an orrery, a device typically used for predicting planetary alignment. In this case, it appears to actually be aligning dimensions. I, for one, do not want the dimensions to align. Not this close to Christmas. That would put a damper on the holidays. How do we shut that thing down? The motion of those devices seems to be generating some sort of energy. Hard to tell, though. What if we tried locking those things down? I can calculate 54 likely outcomes. We'd survive three of them. That beats our usual odds. Unfortunately, you're correct. Let's do it. All right. It looks like the movement of those spheres is stabilizing the interior structure. What if they stop moving? 
So far, this Gooby Island has been a slime tether amusement park. Why should that change now? Lock those spears down, man. I'm trying, dude. I'm trying. We gotta stop those balls from moving. I mean, uh, you know what I mean. Hmm. Do I have a tether stuck to myself? Oh, nice. No, <laughs> um, does it want me to drag them down into the bottom where they'll like latch in? Okay, cool, cool, cool. Pretty straightforward, pretty straightforward. Try to take over the universe, huh? Egon, great. Anyone? Didn't think so. Wait, those planets are aligning. I'm not so sure this is the safest course of action. I think we found the source of the black slime, Winston. I wasn't that curious. The whole room's filling up. Get to higher ground. Already Our there. It's official. This was a bad idea. It's horrible. It smells like the Fulton fish market when they've got fish. Where? I know that dumpster. A putrid mass of hatred, bile, and anger. Not exactly Mr. Sunshine, is it? It's a big boy. Well, we do what we do. Slow. Defeat the juvenile slore. Okay, he's got the eyes that we can no. get with the goo. Get him in the eyes. Get his eyes, rookie. I'm getting him, I'm getting him. We've got to cut off his visor. Somebody chop some onions. Giving me the evil eye, huh? <laughs> it's got to be vulnerable somewhere. Yeah, probably on his giant head. That's not entirely accurate. Statistically speaking, I hope it is. Okay, fair enough. What about that inaccessible anterior nodule? That boy thing on his head? That is his head, isn't it? I'm not sure that mattered. How can we get to it? Hey, Brooke, run around and look delicious, will ya? There it is. Concentrate your fire on that nose. Hit it right there. It doesn't like that at all. I lured it. Are they doing damage? He's taking the bait. Why are you shooting everything but the glowing thing on his head? Gah. Yeah, getting a little too close. Peter's not having a great time over here. Here they come. Get out of here. To the right. Boom, solid. 
On your left! Pour it out! Find some cover! Oh. keep spawning infinitely I I think they might okay I almost got him that was, that was out there. Find some shelter, quick. Oh. no he's glitched he's glitched that's not good that ain't good uh oh there we go there we go there we go hey over here a little help no, oh, are you serious? <laughs> Get out of here. Hey, over here. Knock it off. Hey, more trouble. I'm hit. Ow. That was, that was ow there. Ow. Get out of here. Dude, he's so close. Oh, man. Ow. Look out above you. Got him. All the nodes are closed. The ghosts are trapped in my mouth. Right where they belong. Our boy Evo Shandor didn't factor in that he was messing with the Ghostbusters. <laughs> yeah, Peck made the same mistake. We're gonna have to have a long talk with him. Don't forget that Peter's girlfriend is a Shandor. Very good. You guys need to get down to the shore and fast. I don't know how much longer I can hold her. The whole island's sinking. Ray, keep the motor running. We are coming at you fast. I just realized I didn't scan one of those eyeballs. Heads of over. How was it? Was it cool? What did it look like? Did you get any samples? Did it have multiple eyes? Shut up. Oh, thank God you're here. What's going on, Janine? Where's Alyssa? She's gone. They took her. One minute everything was fine, the next it was chaos. Ghosts flying everywhere. Janine, slow down. Start from the beginning. Okay. Well, I was a little late this morning because one of the heels on my favorite pair of pumps broke, and Lester's was out of my favorite tea. You know how I love my chamomile. Well, and... Okay. Maybe not the beginning. Start where things went haywire around here. Okay. Okay. Somebody jumped me from behind, and before I passed out, I heard Alyssa struggling and yelling, No! And the last thing I remember was the screams of the dead and damned echoing in my brain. So either there was a mass escape from Rikers. <laughs> or someone shut down our containment grid again. Again? Just like Peck threatened to do. It's funny. I always knew that Peck was a pencil-necked bureaucratic prick. But I never pegged him as an evil occultist. But where did he take her? And where are all the ghosts? Because, no offense, but if all the ghosts we've ever caught just escaped, I'm clocking out. Yeah, they would be awfully mad at us. Exactly. It's generally a bad idea for the guards to hang out in the cell blocks just after a prison break. This just in. As authorities continue to supervise the Thanksgiving evacuation of Manhattan, increasingly powerful tremors are rocking Central Park. The question is, where are the Ghostbusters? Uh, tell you what, kind of a nice day. Why don't we go to Central Park? Could round up some ghosts, save the girl, get back in time for a nap. Okay, the Ghostbusters ride again. Alrighty, let's rock and roll. So Peck is an occultist? Or at least they think, they suspect. Be kind of strange. I could see him in a dark robe, though. Oh. 
All right, well. Oh, hi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we got. <laughs> Do these pants just wander around? Nice. All right, well, all the ghosts are ghosts. Oh, they do. They were just walking around. That's adorable. Oh, here they come. No, it doesn't. I looked it up. So he hands me the right, anyway. handbook and tells me to look again. Let's get going. Let's get rocking and rolling. Let's keep this. Let's keep this baby moving. Just once, I wouldn't mind running with these other fools away from the trouble. Where's the fun in that? Any guesses on where we'll find Peck and Alyssa? <laughs> I suspect that we're going to need the super slammer up there. No telling how powerful Peck has grown. That means we gotta take the Ecto-1. I'll drive. Maybe the trainee should drive. Ooh. Nah. Oh, <laughs> oh <laughs> man. Any ideas? We're miming it out. He's giving me a little boosty boost. Ah, Junior's pretty spry, even with that hundred pounds of proton accelerator. Ow! That was that was ow there. Make your way around to the other side and open this gate for us. All right, it's all up to me once again. Going solo. Gate control. Nicely marked for all the dum-dums out there who failed the play test. All right, find a way to open the cemetery's main gate. Oh, we got a blue marky mark already. Look at the storm system built Last time we saw that kind of atmospheric disturbance? That's right. At Dana Barron's building, the night she turned into a dog. Ooh, cursed artifact. Whistling bust of Mausch? The stone bust just won't meet your eye no matter how hard you try. 1734. Frederick der Mausch was a damned sneak and was always up to something. His bust, carved by the Italian genus Marscapone, is the exact same way. Sneaky, sneaky son of a gun. This is cool. No, oh. it's a minor inconvenience. still be happy. In the Gozerian Codex, it's written that a blood sacrifice and a tremendous amount of spiritual energy are needed to generate the supreme destructor form. A destructor form? Again? Peck probably couldn't draw sufficient energy from the Mandala before we shut it down. He found an alternate source in our containment unit. The energy of the escaped ghosts from our grid might be enough to produce a cross-dimensional event itself. Yes, and with Alyssa here, I'm sure her Shandor ancestors aren't far behind. Little sneaky dicky leaky. No artifacts over here? I'm surprised. I'm surprised. Kind of very out of the way. Hmm. Weird.
And obviously we gotta go in here. Hello? Tell me something I don't know, baby. do that much damage to that does it that's pretty good that's not bad speed it up there tiger I'm going yeah. I'm going we don't want to stand here all day that gate control work doesn't that look like a weight okay there we go <laughs> I'll go with the intern nobody should wander around alone in this place We'll meet you guys a little further on. All right, explore the cemetery with Ray. That's a big boy over there. They aren't very happy about us being here. Hmm? Oh. Damn kids, get out of the cemetery. It's disrespectful. They think they're sneaky. Let's spread out and flank them. Why is he always trying to flank them? Coralisha, what's going on, girl? Good to see ya. Whoa, look at them all. You nailed it. Jump out of the way! How you doing? How you doing? Let's close these port holes. Just missed me. Oh, raise down, raise down. That ain't good. Get up, Ray. Sometime today. What do you say? Nice. Let's get this guy with the with the big gun. Get out of here! Jump out of the way. Hey, watch it. Right, let's get him in the trap. Come on, you son of a Get in there. Get in there. Ooh, Settle down. Settle down. Kapow, creep. Play oh, broke free. Yeah, 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 yeah,
got him. I'm doing good, Coralisha. I'm doing good. Thanks for asking. Above you. Oh! Oh, no. All right, got another one, got another one. Let's get him over to the box. Slam him a couple times. Yeah. Box is right here. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Can I actually go back here? You should have run away. Is this where I came in from? Not actually sure. Slimed. You, you okay, Ray? You got you gonna you know you gonna be okay? You know, you know, you're just yelling out random words. down. Ah, oh, he got me. Let's get this boy going. We stirred up a hornet's nest here. Yeah, yeah, slam dunk. Turn around. Have I died? I have I have not. I've been running smooth. Close this portal. Nice, that should help out quite a bit, yeah. Great, we get to submit another one to Tobins. Nice, almost got this boy. Give it to him. Well, I'm giving it to him, all right. Giving it to him real hard, real good. Eyes high. Slam dunk. Beautiful work, Ray. How much ectoplasm can one ghost produce? <laughs> haven't seen many artifacts, although I haven't really been paying attention. I've been engrossed in the battle. Find a way through the crypts. All right, young blood. It's all you. All right, it's all up to me. He's putting he's putting the pressure on. He's testing me.
Use your PKE. All right, he stole that. He stole the statue's head. We got to recover it to open the door. You're all right. Good track. Look behind you. Got him, baby. Kid has some game. There's the key. It's too heavy to carry ourselves. Get it back to the gate so we can keep going. All right. Let's get this sucker back. What? This is so jank. This is am I not doing this right? <laughs> this is so janky. <laughs> it's like an evil Mr. Potato Head. You nailed it. That does lots of damage. That's how we do it, baby. Try to pick up a signal, see what's here. No artifacts, huh? Alrighty. There we go. It's a little easier when it's in front of you. Necromantic shockwave summoned Gozer back to our plane. Why didn't he assume a more effective destructor form immediately? I mean, the Marshmallow Man is scary, sure, but it's <laughs> the way to destroy the world. It's simple. When he enters our plane of existence, he must be locked into that form from our first encounter. One destructor form per god per dimension. I like it. Sounds like the kind of symmetry these things tend to operate on. Hey, so maybe I didn't choose such a bad destructor after all, huh? Surely, whatever makes you feel better, Ray. Totally, buddy. Absolutely. Putting a jacket on, it's friggin' cold, man. The weather for the past, um, the previous three days at my place, the weather was up in the 70s Fahrenheit, and now it just dropped down to like 40 again. Flipping sucks, man. Just like a little tease of nice we of, of nice weather, and then bam, it's gone. Look, up there, it's getting worse. I'd find the other Set Ghostbusters. The I'm used to. You still have your wallet? <laughs> right. Let's find our bros. <laughs> Artifact, a strange black-fruited tree. 
Ghost Fruit Tree, 1983. The extremely rare and delicate ghost fruit tree was imported from the deepest swamps of Louisiana by horticulturist Fran Abernathy. Abernathy hybridized the plant with other strains that she never revealed to make it hardier and easier to grow in slightly less satanic climates. Incredible. That means one of two things. Either we're in trouble or we're dinner. Is there a difference? Hey, we haven't tested proton packs in the rain. That's what the recruit is doing right now. <laughs> Ray, wait a minute. I'm wearing one too. That's true, Ray. How's it going so far? Do you smell any burning or experience any painful tingling? You'll be the first one to know. Or the second. Airstrike! Take those flyers out! Are you scanning that guy? Must have. Alright, let's get this bad boy. Let's get a trap on the ground. Oh, it's like right on it. Are you serious? There we go. You've got him on the ropes. Beautiful baby. Solid kid. Same team. You rang his bell, did I? What am I doing now? Am I just waiting for the enemies to stop or like where am I going? Continue to explore the cemetery with Ray. Find a way to link back up with okay, there's nothing specific. Oops. Do we go this way? Sure do. One more. Yeah, baby. This gun does a lot of damage. Look behind you. Come on, let's go.
Hmm. Oh my lord! Alright, take care of the big boy first. Ray's getting thrown around like a rag doll. Yeah, I can see that. Get behind something. Up high. Find some cover. Raise down. I'm hit. I'm hit. I'm coming, buddy. Get a trap out. Ooh. Got one, got one, got one. You own that creature. All yours. Yeah, baby. Get it. Oh. Hey, watch it. Now that hurt. They felt that one in Pittsburgh. Got him. Uh oh. Here they come. Above you! Ooh, man! Raise down. Uh, don't stop! Just missed me. Play it out. That hurt! Now that hurt! Kapow, creep! Trying to slam dunk him. Yeah, you. you dick. There we go. Let's go get Ray. What do you say? Got another one. Ooh, painful. You own that creep. Whammo! That hurt. Now you took a good shot. It's on your left. Keep it going. Save your time. You own that creep. That hurts. Wham! Now that hurts. Wham! They felt that one. Got him. Come on, let's go. Beautiful. Well, hello there. Great. You guys all right? Man, there ain't nothing dead in this graveyard. Thanks for joining the party. They're throwing everything they have at us to stop us from getting to that mausoleum. That's as far as I can go. You guys got a clear path for me. Ray, readings here are extremely unstable. Energy from the mandala and the escaped ghost is building up to a flashpoint. We don't have much time. Yeah, that's good. Thanks. Rolling on. That's easy. Well, I guess we're going in there. We don't have a lot of choice. Prevent the apocalypse, that is. Bag nabbit. Ow! Can't scan it for me. Oh, there. We got it. We got it. 
The skull of Evo Shandor. Convinced that society was too sick to survive, Evo Shandor created a cult dedicated to bringing about the end of the world. He had more than 1,000 followers when he died, and they made sure he was in interred in dramatic fashion. Following hours of Gozerian rituals, his body was carefully placed in a dramatic, if unnerving, mausoleum. In the end, however, time and decay did to him what they do for all, with one exception. Though he rests in pieces, Shandor doesn't rest in peace, and his skull occasionally lapses into ranting fits, and the odd sol soliloquies on disappointment and faded glory. Sad. Jump out of the way! Put my head off! More than I expected. You rang his bell, cadet. Drop the boots. Man, I love it when the lightning strikes and you can uh, you can see the environment light up. Looks real cool. Put the hose on him, Rook. Hey, over here, little help. Yo, little help. We've tried everything. This metal is psychonically charged, rendering it effectively indestructible. <laughs> well, in such an extreme situation, I suppose it's possible to cause it harm, but I don't think anything we have is going to make a dent in it. Then what's our plan? Ray, you two check out that side. I think I'm picking up something on it. What's your take on this? An indestructible gate attached to a damaged frame. A few concussive hits and the hinges might just break loose. Some good thinking. Uh, 12 o'clock high. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> he just punched you right in the They're face! Our energy streams aren't going to hurt them. Peter, go kick them. The only hope we have is to stay alive and keep them away from the Echo. I wholeheartedly agree with Rick. More precisely, their little stone aim is capable of attaining speeds of 198 feet per second before they hit their targets, which is us. I'm a cocky aim. Man, I'm going back to Sunday. The particle throwers aren't doing anything to them. Tether them and smash them into something! So he said I gotta damage the frame around the gate. That's good. Oh working. god almighty. Looks like a good place for slime tethering. Okay, we gotta use the tethers. Follow my lead. Damn, there's a lot of these guys. Stupid little babies, man. They're like little cupids. Hook them together. Oh, gosh. How about some slime tethering? Damn, there's a lot of these guys. The kid's on to something. Oh, I got one of them. They are whooping my ass. Is 
Is it because I'm slamming these guys into it that it, that? It, oh no way! I think I maybe I gotta slime the, or I mean I gotta slam the dudes into it. I don't know. It's kind of unclear. They were giving me audio cues to use the slime tethers though. That was odd. Yo, new guy. We've tried everything. This metal is psychonically charged, rendering it effectively indestructible. Uh -huh. Well, in such an extreme situation, I suppose it's possible to cause it harm, but I don't think anything we have is going to make a dent in it. Then what's our plan? Ray, you two check out that side. I think I'm picking up something off here. What's your take on this? Or maybe I need to tether these to the flying dudes. That'd be kind of hard, though. Yes, and the hinges might just break loose. Uh, 12 o'clock high. Ah! <laughs> The two well protected. Are, are you serious, dude? Peter, go kick one. The only hope we have is to stay alive and keep them away from the echo. I wholeheartedly agree with Rick. More precisely, they're little stone angels capable of attaining speeds of 198 feet per second before they hit their targets, which is us. Got one. Particle throwers aren't doing anything to them. Tether them and smash them into something. No! Yeah, yeah, gotta smash them into the into the thingy. There we go. That was a lot easier than last time for some reason. I think we're getting close. Hey guys, a little help? I bet we could pull these gates down. Hey Rick, we got a chain or winch for this thing? I didn't plan for a fun-filled day of off-roading with Echo One, so no. The tether might prove useful. Okay, kid. Tether the gate to my bumper, and I'll pull it down. Okay, good. Give me a few more, just to be sure. Now we're yeah. talking. This way, gentlemen. Thank you. Nicely done. I'm not sure going underground now is a good idea. Come on, Spangs. Getting there is the fun part. Careful, this matrix is becoming increasingly unstable. Uh oh. Totally. Check that out. That's our next stop. Ever feel like you're being watched? Egon. What? Shh. Please. Get ready. Same drill as before. Hook me up again. I'll take care of it. Right, the tethers. Others held. My fault. Miscalculated. Winston! Oh, man. Yeah. There's no, stop for real. There's no way that I car won. would have enough power anyway to do that. She took that pretty hard. Can you get her rolling again? Nah. Crickets. She's down for the count, guys. I hate leaving her here like this. I know it, Ray. This is definitely turning into a bad neighborhood. But we've got to keep moving. Guess we're walking from here. Some of us have been walking. Keep your eyes peeled! I think we've got guests. I knew it! I think we're gonna wish we had that super slammer. These guys are just chilling back here, doing their thing. Got one ghost coming up. Hey, over here, little help? Yo, little help? Oh yeah, come down here and say that. Multiple contact. Hey, over here. Got gotcha, you, buddy. Here we are. I think you're gonna be all right. And we're gonna help this man. This is like a monster 
Yeah, we got him, we got him, we got him, we got him. Let's get his ass over. And in he goes. Yeah, baby. The strength is failing. Aim high. Ha. Oh, great. A whole mess of them. Well, Slam dunk. Keep it going. It's on your left. Behind you. Aim high. Uh oh. Here they come. Sweet, 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 sweet. Let's get him in the box. They fell back one in Pittsburgh. Beautiful. Scan it for the spirit guy. What kind of lock the gate? Woo! That's a big boy. They are? Peter's down. Oh, sure. I see it now. Where are the keys then? Big damage, big damage. Are you serious? Here they come. Oh. Run! Oh! Almost got him. Ow! That was, that was Dunzos. One one down. Don't have to watch out for you. That was close. Two of my guys are down. Let's get them both up. Don't mess with me, man. Getting a little intense here in the back. Man. This one's ready for the trap. Get out of here. Anybody? Two of my guys are down. That ain't good. If I go down, it's gonna be bad news. Minro. Oh, no, you serious? Get up, get your ass up, boy. Help me. Oh! <laughs> I hate it when they're cocky. That's it. Run! It may be possible to harness their interdimensional cranial energy source. Well, how would we go about doing that? Damn. Get him. You gotta think of something. Use your head, kid. Heck, use theirs. Alright, let's go plug these in. Or not. Okay, okay cool, 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 cool. The kid's on to something. I'm always out of something. Hey to go! Great! Those fellas turned out to be pretty helpful. This team can play, no doubt about it. Exciting, and somehow risky. Alright, let's get on in there, baby. Wait, it's Ilisa. It's Peck. Can we blast him? This one's really hard. Nobody's gonna know. Easy, Venkman. Everything points to Peck being a pawn. <laughs> I couldn't have said it better myself. It's the mayor. No, Ray, it's not. It's Evo Shandor. Shandor <laughs> possessed the mayor, turned Peck on us to slow us down, and when we shut down his Mandela before he could get fully juiced, he hijacked our ghost out of the containment unit as an alternate energy source. Very good. And they say you're the slow one. Wait, what? Who says that? Everybody. What's the girl <laughs> have to do with it? Taking her was necessary. To assume my own destructor form, I require blood. My blood. What about Gozer? 
I thought you built this all for him. I did, but he failed me. Twice. How he earned the title the Destroyer is beyond me. Anyway, I thought to myself, why worship a god when you can actually become one? Slime him. Really? G to the roadie. Oh no! The game crashed. Can't allocate a texture on the video card. Please lower your graphics settings. What? Are you for realsies right now? Are you for real? Hold on, guys. What the hell? <laughs> Are you serious? Oh no. Is that going to make me restart the whole mission? What is this? What is this? Damn it, now I'm going to get a copyright strike for the music. Son of a biscuit. <laughs> oh, I got to do this whole battle again? F off. The flowing indentations are obviously keyhole. They are? Oh, sure, I see it now. Where are the keys, then? Well, hopefully, if it crashes again, I'll turn my graphics settings down, but I don't know why I would need to. It's kind of weird. It's a game from 2009. Find some cover! Oh. Of right in the dick. All right, we got one of them. Winston's down, just got curb stomped. Hold on! Look behind you. Ooh, that's smart. It's a whole swarm. Ray's down. Need some help here. Oh! Ow! Help us on the way. Too far. <laughs> That's got to be the key. It is the key, bro. Do I get in there? <laughs> Come on, guys, let's put our heads together. <laughs> All right, let's see if it crashes again, guys. Let's see if we're going to be okay here. I should be able to skip this cutscene. I do hey, believe. Great. Those fellas turned out to be pretty helpful. This team can play, no doubt about it. Exciting. And somehow risky. Alright. Let's see. Cross your fingers. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Yes, we're good. <laughs> Oh! Damn! I'm gonna destroy his protective shield. Behind! Get out of here! How do we do that? He's too powerful. It'll take all of our streams. Oh, we got we gotta pull it open. Cool. I think I'm onto it. I think I'm onto something. Someone would just help me up, please. Uh, I mean, I, I don't mind taking a rest, you know, taking a breather, but. Ah, oh, you serious? Multiple contacts. Hey, over here. I'm on it. 
Hang on. Oh. Good idea. Got one. Okay. Step one. All right. I see what you're doing. Almost there. Can you emulate what I'm doing as well? That'd be really helpful. Job well done. Mission fail. Everybody went down. What the flip? These guys are the worst. You got it. Okay. Step one. Job well done. Egon's down already. Almost there. Too powerful. It'll take all of our strength. Winston's down. Do that again. It's fading. Let's go get his ass up. Okay, he's only got one shield left. We are rocking and rolling. Everybody's down? Are you serious? Help me! It's like a giant tornado appeared and just took them all out. Could be trouble. Get out of here! Hey, come over here. A little help? Yo, a little help? Alright, see if we can do this. See if we can do this thing. Keep it coming. Hey, over here. The kid's on the sub. Beat him down. Then get a capture stream on him. Two of my dudes are down. Okay, they're back up. Back up. He's through. Now deactivate your pulse, and we'll cross the streams with the blast function. I can't shut mine down, Ray. Me too. Me neither. I mean, who decided to reinforce these shoulder straps? Yeah. Oh. Hey, Shandor. Where's your destructor form now? Leave it in your other suit. I have chosen it. I am the destructor. I am the architect. Oh, I didn't scan him. Yo, Nori, what's going on, man? Good to oh. see you. Was someone waking out of their nap? Oh, no. That's very bad. The architect? <laughs> that's not so scary. The contractor, that's what kills you. Peter, you don't understand. He's the architect, and he controls Ghost World. And he can come into our world. And what do architects do? I... They have automatic pencils. I don't know. I will pay for your feelings to start anew. That's rude. I will fill your seas with concrete and stone. Why? What's your problem? Well, What's this guy's deal? Break. Do you ever shut up? Yeah. No! Listen! I will pierce your world with girders of steel and panes of glass. That's just mean supervillain grits, right? All those guys talk like that. I will crush your world under the weight of my secrets. Pretty well so far. Look out! It's using shielding. It's getting stronger. Oh, he is. He's. Oh, he is powering up. Okay, we got to destroy his little shield generator things. Beautiful, beautiful. Nice, 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 nice. Not too, pro not not too shabby. Not too much of a problem. Oh, 
Oh, nerd. Okay, he's got a fire NATO. That's, that's pretty cool. Charge up. It's protecting itself. Don't let it recharge. Give Rat. it more. Well, he recharged a little bit. Wasn't too bad. As a quick boy. We've got to get through this shielding. It's growing stronger. Oh, laggy. Whoa. Oh, the lag is real. Flashing. Sorry, behind. <laughs> He's going down, baby. He's the architect of his own demise. It's, it's time. Cross the streams. We eat gods for breakfast. Activating the cross stream governor. I never thought I'd say this again. Cross the stream. We eat gods for breakfast? Too much, you think? No, I liked it. <laughs> I've got you. Get me down from here. Please, Nuga. I'm begging you, let You're me down. Huh? <clears throat> this is not the last you will see of me. Hey, fellas, what are you doing here? What am I doing here? Uh, where is here? You were the victim of a trans-dimensional possession, Your Honor. Uh, what's that mean? An evil ghost was walking around in your body for a few months. Whoa, did anyone notice? Well, how's my approval rating? Well, you got reelected. <laughs> By the way, you're a descendant of Shandor. Yeah, I kinda got that. No, she's way too young for him. What? Are you kidding me? And there it is. I enjoyed that. It was nice. But it wasn't like an amazing game, but it was solid. It was good. It was a good time. Pretty cohesive story, you know? Really uh, hit the same beats as the movies. So if you're a fan of the movies, probably a fan of the video game. Anyway, uh, hope you guys had fun. Hope you enjoyed. I probably could have done that all in one long stream, but I wasn't sure how much more time I had left. But that's fine. It's good to split up the streams, make it so they're not like eight hours long in total. Is there anything after the credits? Probably not. I just pressed escape. Let's see what happens. Probably nothing, right? Nothing! By the way, there's no multiplayer. I noticed you said that the other day, Noir, right? 
But uh, I think multiplayer got discontinued like years ago because it doesn't even exist. It's gone. Not even a thing. <laughs> That's kind of a bummer. Anyway, hope you, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. As always, if you did a thumbs up and a subscription, would be mucho excelente. And with that, I will see you fine folks in the next one. See you later, peeps.